All right, everybody, it's Super Josh 171 back with another video. This one's against a guy named Soul, and I'm sorry it's been so long since my last one. I know I don't have that many followers, but hey, if you want to watch, here we go. It's something new. All right, I'm going to start out with my hammered hat. I'm going to mess with my team a little bit in these next few fights, just kind of adjusting and readjusting and whatnot, trying out some new Pokemon. So you might see some new things. You might see some old things. They're just going to be some things, okay? So start off the way we started off. Get hit with the EQ, which is big. Threw out a waterfall first. Hit him with the second one. And he's going to EQ me to, well, take me out, sadly. But that's all right. Come into my 360. He tried to sucker punch, but I hit him with Toxic, so it worked beautifully for me. And I think he's going to pull him out here. Throws out his Chompers. I don't think I've fought a model before, but there's a first for everything, right? So I stone the team, and then I throw out my Earth Power. Shookaberry weakens it, so it didn't take him out in one hit. He gets a Swords Dance, and now he's going to get the Priority Sucker Punch in. Taking me to just under half, well actually just over a third health before I kill him. And then I believe he's going to come back in with his Mama, go for a Sucker Punch too. Yep, oh, here it comes. Oh, that's right, he fakes out first. Get the flinch. A little bit of leftovers recovery is going to give me just enough health to survive the sucker punch. And I'm going to earth power for the kill. And then he's going to throw out his melodic, I can't remember its name, Sea God, there we go. And I'm going to hit it with a toxic just because, well, I know that they hate that puts me to sleep and I made the mistake here of not switching out. I should have swapped out for my fire petal right now for my Venusaur. But I left him in just to get killed. I'm not so good at getting my sleepers out. I just leave him in, let him die, and then let him put somebody else to sleep. One of these days I'll learn though. So now I throw out my fire petal miss with my leech seed he hits with a second hypnosis and I'm gonna have some terrible luck with accuracy in just a minute here but we'll get there when we get there so poison's draining him a little bit he's gonna get him out and throw out his chicken and I stay asleep this turn head out throw out my lightning and he's gonna get the speed boost on him that he didn't need his Thunder Punch is going to do really well against me. Get a Calm Mind boost here. Second Thunder Punch isn't going to do quite as much as the first. I'm going to slack that off. And he pulls him out, throws out the Sea God again, thinking that he's going to be able to wall me pretty well. He probably thinks that I have my Surf Psychic combination. So I'm going to surprise him a little bit here by throwing out a Shadow Ball. I do want to calm mind up one or two more times here. And since I know he's just going to try to mirror coat everything I do, I figure I might as well build it up enough until I can kill it in one shot. So I'm going to calm mind again. That puts me at plus two for my special attack and special defense. I think I'm going to do it one more time on his switch here. Take half health with the Stealth Rocks in, which is nice. Because I hate Legendaries. Whether they're underused or never used, I still hate them. So, Shadow Ball, it don't quite get enough damage. And it does get the speed boost. He uses Toxic, and I have my Berry to get rid of it. And for some reason, he didn't do it again. He Ice Beamed, and I just missed with my... Um, focus Blast right there too, which is one of my terrible accuracy misses. Sea God comes back out, surfs me for minimal damage, throw out the Shadow Ball to take him. 
or her. And throws out his KFC. Hits me with the Thunder Punch, and I'm going to throw out another missing Focus Blast. So that's two Focus Blasts in a row that miss. And he's going to take me down with the Thunder Punch. I was hoping to get him much lower in health than he is now so that my stank could deal with him. He does have Fire Blast, which is nice for him. It's going to take me down pretty low, and I'm hoping that because I've missed twice on an attack that should have maybe missed once, that I'll get some paralysis, and luckily I do. So that'll give me priority. Hit him with another T-Bolt, take him out. And then get a little Black Sludge Recovery, which isn't going to do me any good. Throws out his Frost Last Jinx. And Psychics for the easy kill. And then I'm going to come in with my Norbert, thinking that she's going to try to put me to sleep. I throw out the sub, hoping she was going to try to put me to sleep, but she's just going to attack. So since that went down, I figured I might as well fire punch. It should be an easy one hit after the stealth rock damage, and it was. So that's the end of that one. Got my Charizard left and then a, well, sleeping Venusaur. So thanks for watching, guys. Again, sorry it's been so long, and I'll get a couple more up today, so hopefully they keep you entertained.